have it, Usher Anderson, Hilpit, Vivas, Laborte, Gallenero, and uh, Dionela as the libero for uh, the HD Spikers. Head coach, uh, Sami Akailar. Para naman po sa Lady Slammers, Kumabaw, Todorovic, Dadang, Olgard, Pablo, Dowd, and Makandili as the libero. Para naman po sa Phillips Gold. Chiki Ray is here with uh, Chiki Pablo and completing our trio. We got Carla Lizardo at the sides. And this is the second playing date of your Filipino Superliga Grand Prix 2015. And first to serve here, Chiki. Signal HD Spikers with their setter, April Hingpit on deck. That's a good serve from Hingpit. And you were talking about Myla Pablo. Nung warm-up sa partner na parang ganda nung groove niya, ganda nung talon. And uh, that went a little bit wide. But ito yung talon na, no? Oh, yung palo, yung power behind that hit of Myla. That's right. Let's see how she'll recover. One serving zero. Lady Slammers from the back. And first point of their celebrated import, Boyana. Todorovic, na nagdaro sa UCLA. Yes, very smart move from Todorovic. Um, um, Signal was waiting for a really powerful hit from her, but she saw na nag back na yung mga players, so she did a, an off speed. Oh, wow. Can I say Tower of Power? Yeah, you surely can. At the net. You've got all guard there. Medyo mahihirapan ng Signal, baka lusot sa block ni all guard. That's a great block, and uh, Actually, the hit of uh, Mumay Vivas was actually powerful already. Yes. Laborte, the veteran for uh, Signal. Meantime, Boyana with her second point in PSL. Boyana showing us the different hits that she can make. First with an off speed and then now with a powerful hit that really just landed on the line. People uh, in the, the camp of Phillips School that told me that uh, his nickname was Bo. Bo. Uh, How many artists are known to Bo Darren? That's right. Oh, uh, it's revealing our age here. <laughs> Olgar with a powerful hit, and it's 4 1 in favor of Phillips Gold. Oh, my, oh, my. And you know, according to uh, Lindsay Dowd, that's her favorite set, the middle. And by the way, that all guard is hitting that ball in the middle, we can expect a lot of quick, quick, quick hits from her. It's four serving one. And Phillips Gold, the revamped Phillips Gold, off to a good start. Pablo with a gift. And she will cash in on that. You know, this is also almost what happened to Signal when they went up on opening day. They started out a little bit slow on the momentum and then they just slowly picked it up. So let's see if this new first six of Coach Sammy is going to um, deliver a good first set. Four point lead for the Lady Slammers. Pablo, no one was there. There was a big space, a donut, if I may say. Well, the main difference that I can see here is that Phillips Gold is having such a good time playing. They're just smiling and they're just really having fun. And the signal is stressed because they're down by five. Six to one is our score. Five or six straight points coming from the Lady Slammers. The captain on the other side. So, Subukang Signal HD. Dowd to Pablo. Ball is still alive. Great rally we're witnessing. Vivas. From the back. Soft touch there. And that's another point for Bo. You know, once again, Bo looks first at the floor defense of Signal before hitting that ball. And that's why nakita niya, may buta solid sa zone 6. And that's where she directed that ball. Correct me if I'm wrong. Signal scored the first point. Am I right? And then after that, it's been Phillips. All the way, let's see. Anong isasagot dito ng Signal HD Spikers? Ball Good. is still alive. Lady Slammers will try again. King Pitt will set it up. Oh, that's a good hit of the deflection coming from Fritz Joy Gallinero. And Gallinero did that also in her first game. A lot of 
of really brave hits considering that she had tall blockers across the net. Wala, wala sa kanya yun. Basta, she'll hit that ball hard. I asked permission dito kay um, uh, Jack Junella at ang tawag nila kay uh, Fritz Joy ay si Cuba. But more of that story when we return. Ang score po natin, 8-2, pabor po sa Phillips Gold. Our first technical timeout in set number two. We'll, uh, set number one, we'll be right back. Let's talk about the imports here. Alexis Olgard, as mentioned earlier, the imports are in town. Look at the height, 6'5", at the age 24 years old. Very young, Chiki. Very young. Um, dad nya is a two-time all-conference lineman in football in college. Wow. Sister nya Emma is also a middle blocker who plays for the Montana women's volleyball team. Her favorite movie is Love and Basketball. Look at that. Yes. You know, I have to uh, admire the moniker that James gave you, the professor. Time to tinuturo sa amin from uh, the background to the type of play. All right. <laughs> Nine two. Phillips up by seven. Soft touch from the big girl, that's Usher. I guess one of the advantages of being tall is that you can see what happens across the court before you hit that ball. And that was a smart play from Usher. And when she played on opening day, she set the bar high. She was really important to her imports. She was going to get 31 points. Yeah, and you have to admire the mental toughness of Signal. Never gave up. Bow. With that hit, and she will score off the deflection or off the hit from the other side. And Phillips Gold still up by 7, 10 to 3. It's 10 serving 3 and serving 4. Phillips Gold from the USC Trojans, Alexis Olgard. Todo, USNCA Division 1 player. And when you say you're in the Division 1 of the NCAA, talagang cream of the crop yan. Oh, yes, oh, yes, indeed. And you can see. Talaga naman display of volleyball skills. There was an, uh, an infraction, an error. A lifting violation called by the first referee. That was Jocelyn De Rosario calling that infraction. We have a timeout here called by Coach Sammy. Kaya hindi naman rocket science to partner na kinakailangan nilang samantalahin itong mga import nila. No? Like si Asher na napakatangkad. Uh -oh. Ang problema lang sa kabila, si Bow nandyan, nandun din si Olgaard na kapwa matatangkad naman na laro. Right. So, ito lang, ano na lang to, waisan sa play ng, ng setter. That Utakan. ball. Oh, takan. Ito, that ball that go over the net. Four, Four touches. Ang yeah. tinawag sa Phillips Gold. And uh, I have to admire both uh, liberos here. Uh, Bionella and uh, Gohin, uh, they are all over the floor. Yes. Maganda tingnan, they're doing their jobs well. Four serving 11. That was Vivas on your screens earlier. Meantime... Soft touch there coming from Allgaard. HD Spikers. Back to Phillips Gold. Bow. Chance ball there. April. Running hit. And Anderson will chalk up a point para sa signal HD. A good running hit there for Anderson. You know, the good thing about... Look at this replay. There's the set from in fifth. And actually, may malaking butas eh, in between Bo and Desiree Dada. Kaya hindi na-block talaga ng maayos yung... Hindi pulido. Oo. Oh, oh. Malaki yung butas eh. And kayo mga volleyball players, uh, you have to look at those uh, gaps. Yes. Yes, definitely. You know what? The blockers of Signal were there. Usher and Anderson were there for Bo's hit. So two straight points coming from the Signal HD Spikers here. Vivas. That's a uh, service, service error. error coming from Vivas. So that's a free point. Arabusa Phillips School, the Mosila Nagani, 12 to 6. And you know, when I was talking to both coaches, Coach Francis for Phillips School and Coach Sammy for Signal, but I only looked at it in a very tightly knit na itong dalawang kupunan na to. And that's very important kasi kung close kayo outside the court, dapat mag-translate yan inside the court. And that's one of the reasons why maganda pa na orin to. Tsaka ang ano, napag-usapan na natin ng kaunti dito. Ang burden of adjustment pag may imports ka, hindi sa imports eh, sa local. A-adjust ka kasi dun sa dinad. May language barrier, sabi mo na medyo hindi right. nagkakaintindihan sa umpisa. But really, sa dami nyo, kayong a-adjust sa imports eh. O, oh, kayo lang, ang sabi ng both coaches, ha, Coach Francis and Coach Sammy, is that the imports were the ones willing to adjust to the Filipino system. Oh, that's a good sign. Yeah. Bo, with a hit, cross-court is good. 
ang ganda ng palo ni Bo kasi yung bola niya, cross-court hit na, angled pa. Kaya ang hirap i-block, ang hirap i-receive. Look at this replay. Iniwasan niya yung blockers. Actually, the last moment din, binaba ni Anderson yung kamay niya eh. Okay. Alam mo, I have to agree with you, yung palo niya, kita mo, hindi man lang din niya eh. Pasok oh, na pasok eh. talaga eh. Oo, oh, tapos kakaiba yung angle niya eh. Signal down by six, great net defense. And good floor defense there from Signal. Lindsay to Myla. Oh, great dig. At the net. Lady Slammers on the attack. Pablo once more. And they will score off the deflection. Dinaan ni Myla yung hit niya kay, ano, kay Hingpit. Mas maliit na blocker. And that's why she got that easy off the block point. It's a seven point lead para po sa Phillips Cold. Lady Slammers 14, serving seven. Boyana Todorovic serving for Phillips Gold. To the back, that was out. Medyo malakas ang palo ni uh, Gallinero. Si Gallinero, one year siyang hindi nakapag-volleyball. So, can you just imagine kung talaga ano siya? In shape, na in shape. Pero alam mo ba, itong si Gallinero ay uh, 20 anos lamang to. Wow. Magto 21 lang to sa October 28. So... Marami, marami pa yan na oh. ipapakita sa volleyball, for sure. Myla. Hingpit, running hit once more. That's her favorite. Si Hingpit has mastered the set that Amanda Anderson wants in a running hit. Look at that. Very perfect height, perfect distance. At ang galing din ni Amanda Anderson. Even if it was slightly off, nagawa niya na paraan. And the running hit, Chiki Pablo, yeah. correct me if I'm wrong. Hindi madali yan. Oo, oh, hindi. Kasi sa timing. Quick one here. But it backfired. Para sa Lady Stammers, the intention was good. The height was okay. The hit was powerful. Uh, but it went wide. It just went wide. So, ano mga bante ng Phillips goal? It's 9 serving 15. Anderson serving for single HD. They go. To their import there. Signal naman po ang susubok. Our all guard couldn't contain itong palo ni Gallinero. All guard, I think, at that time was a little bit high when she was waiting. So if she had gone lower, closer to the ground, makikita niya na yung bola eh mataas. Kaya kung pinabayaan niyo, ngayon, it would have gone out. Amanda on deck. They're down by five. Pablo with a save. Chance ball here. Hingpit at the net. Quick one to Laborte. Pablo against two defenders. From the back. Oh, great net defense. Shown by Lindsay Dowd. And our score is 16 to 10 in favor of Phillips Code. Our second technical timeout in set number one. Babalik po ang inyong PSL Grand Prix 2015. At pag-usapan naman natin ang isa sa mga imports ng Lady Slammers, si Boyana Todorovic, a middle blocker mula sa America. 5'11 ang kanyang height at uh, naglaro sa Cal State University sa Long Beach. Yes, ito NCAA Division 1 player din siya. She started playing when she was 7 years old. She went she wow. went to the States, uh, migrated there but did not know an English word. But she joined the volleyball club and played even though hindi niya maintindihan yung mga kakampi niya at hindi rin siya maintindihan ng mga kakampi niya. But one thing that she really did inside the court, she was really loud. And that served well. And ngayon, magaling na mag-English. Magaling na mag-English. 16-11 ang ating score. Signal still down by 5. Lindsay to Pablo, there's an infraction here from the set. Double. Double. Lindsay Dowd. Rarely do you see an error kay Lindsay Dowd because I saw her play already nung pagtuntong niya sa Pilipinas mga four weeks ago or a month ago. Usually nga, halos hindi ko napansin yun eh. Pero usually makikita mo yung double sa spin ng bola. Eh, international refereeing meron natin oh, si Miss Jocelyn Del Rosario. Kaya alam na alam na yan. Great net defense, Laborte and Viva sending a message to Myla Pablo, not here. Not now. Not here, not now. What a wall of a block. Look at this replay. Myla goes up for that hit. Vivas 
almost alone in that block. Yes, this is an all-new Philips Gold lineup. So the big question is how well will they gel together? But watching them warm up earlier and then seeing their teammates on the bench, cheering their teammates on the court, here's the sidelines, going crazy. We can really see na kakaiba yung chemistry nitong team na to this time around. And actually, Michelle Gumabao confirmed that to me earlier. She said that all of them get along really well, pati yung mga imports nila. Balik sa inyo. Gelling is key. Having a good time is key. Kanina nga, yung warm-up ito ng Philips Gold, eh, nagkakabulan sila dito. Oo oh, nga. At alam mo, sabi nga ni Michelle Gumabaw, this team is the closest team na she's ever had. Talagang super close sila, even if you compare it sa college days. That replay, he leave us with a good hit in between the blocks of uh, Philips Gold. Let me use that word na ginamit mo lang, close. Yes. Dumikit na dito ang signal. We're only down by two, but as I finish that sentence, service error naman ng binigay ni April Hingpit. So, balik sa tatlong kalamangan ng Philips ko. At sabi nga kanina ni Coach Francis, no? Okay, all guard. Your blockers are a little bit small. Ano kaya ako? Very small ka na dyan. Very. Oh! Kinapos. Itong balak ni Mumay Vivas. Wanting to... Put that ball right over the net, lang sa pero hindi nabuti. Yes. Siguro na ilang din because Alexis was there in front of her. Yes. Makakana intimidate a little bit. Dao dang nag serve para sa Phillips School. They're up by four. Going down. That setup has been picture perfect for Phillips School. Ito nga yung sinasabi ni Coach Francis. She can't have a quick play if there is no first ball. Look at that. Talaga namang line, bumabagsak ang bola ni Allgaard, or almost on the attack line. 19-14, Phillips up by 5. Great dig coming from Gohing. Laborte, another dig from Gohing. Pablo, that's an open space. And that's another point for Phillips goal. Nicely done by Pablo. What she did was she, she Timed it perfectly, nag off speed siya, so that the ball hit just the tips of the fingers of the blockers and it rolled down the arms. Kaya walang coverage, ang hirap i cover nun. I was about to say na yung floor defense ang signal maganda, pero sino ba mag-aakalang babagsak dun sa harap ng net? Ano? Correct. And the point will go. Overreaching, okay. Overreaching si uh, Laborte. So that point will go to Philip Scholder up. 21-14, and uh, on deck is uh, Lindsay Dowd. Oh, that's a service error from Lindsay, giving signal their 15th point. That's something that you won't expect, because considering in her in her credentials, talagang ano eh, fear you have to fear you have to fear her services, kasi ganon kaganda yung mga services ni Dowd, but. You know, hindi naman perfect of players. Tsaka ganun talagang uh, service, ano, ano. Ironically, people say that's the easiest, oh. pero ironically, yung pinakamayin na. Oh. <laughs> Ikaw na lang yun, wala kang kalaban. Oh, and especially ito, si Dowd, eh, siya yung setter, so she runs around, nakakapagod din yun. The fatigue factor, I'm about to say that as well. Seven points ang pagitan po ng Philips Cold at ng Signal HD, and uh, on deck, or bago mag-serve, itong si Myla Pablo, humingi ng timeout. Oh, kaya ang instruction nga ni Coach Sammy, eh, contain the errors. Yan. Kasi na, lagi sila nagkakamali. So, tsaka ngayon, very important instruction for get the pass and move on. You mentioned errors. Pinoint out mo yan sa akin. Kanina, ilan yung error nila nung game number one? Oo oh, nga, 34 errors. Aray ko po. Yes. So, Napakalaki mo. That's something that Signal will need to watch out, di ba? Yes, yes. Definitely. Pero ito, uh, Chick, walo na. Ang abante ng ladies numbers, 23-15 with Myla Pablo on deck to serve for Phillips Gold. And now Angustia steps in for Mick Mick Laborte. Pablo. Merong nakangiti ang ating second referee na si Lumer Paharillo. At nagkaroon ng konting kwentuhan with Coach Samia Kaila. Meantime, Signal HD. Vivas. Dowd will set up. Bow. Balik sa signal. Oh, great hit. Great dig. Ball is still alive. Once more, height is might. Hindi pa rin. At the net, who will win? And that point will go to Phillips Gold. You know, I don't see 
bow, she just tried to save that ball. It was too close to the net. The fist big shot. But you know, the Kamale uh, uh, signal to Sinidas with a net attraction. Four attacks for Myla. Set point for Philip Skold. 24-15 is our score here. Set number one. Bow. Great dig. Quick one there. Ball is still alive. Balikay Todorovic. And Malik ang reception ni Ariel Usher. That's the final score in set number one. Our score, Phillips 25, Signal HD 15. Tapos na po ang set number one, set number two when we return.